A right angle triangle has an area of 24 square units and a hypotenuse of 10 units. Find the lengths of the other two sides. So this is the right angle triangle here. The hypotenuse AC here is 10 cm. We have to find the other two missing sides. Now remember that this figure is not true to scale just for presentation. Given area is 24 cm square, the hypotenuse is 10 cm. Now in the right angle triangle, area of a triangle is half into base into height. If we consider BC as lowercase b, AB as lowercase a and AC as lowercase c, then area will be 1 upon 2 times AB and that is equal to 24 cm square. From here we can find AB is equal to 48 cm square. Let this be equation 1. Now, in a right angle triangle, as per the Pythagorean theorem, square of hypotenuse is equal to the sum of squares of two opposite sides. That means square of hypotenuse, that is C square, it is equal to sum of squares of two opposite sides, that is A square plus B square. The hypotenuse given is 10 cm square, so we can write it as 10 square, and this is equal to a square plus b square or 100 is equal to a square plus b square from equation 1 we have a b is equal to 48 centimeter or we can say b is equal to 48 upon a so we can substitute the value of b here in terms of a so 100 is equal to a square plus 48 upon a square or 100 is equal to a square upon 48 square upon a square. Let's multiply both the sides by a square then it is 100 a square. This is a to the power 4 plus 48 square or we can write here a to the power 4 plus 48 square is 2304 minus 100 a square is equal to 0. We can rearrange it to make it a quadratic equation a to the power 4 minus 100 a square plus 2304 is equal to 0. Let's factorize it to find two factors whose sum is equal to 100 and whose product should be equal to 2304. So 2304 this is actually 48 times 48. 48 we can write 16 times 3. 16 times 3, then 16 as 4 times 4. Now 4 times 4 times 4 is 64. Then times 3 times 4, 12, 12 times 3, 36. So 64 times 36 equal to 2304. And 64 plus 36 will be minus 64. Minus 36 will be equal to minus 100. So we can use the two numbers. 64 and 36. So a to the power 4 minus 64 a square minus 36 a square plus 2304 is equal to 0. Or take a, sorry, this is a to the power 4. Take a to the power 2 as common a square minus 64 and minus 36 a square minus 64 is equal to 0. Now a square minus 36 and a square minus 64 as two factors. Now two solutions for a when a square minus 36 is equal to 0 then a square is equal to 36 or a is square root of 36 or a is equal to 6 when a square minus 64 is equal to 0 then a square is equal to 64 or a is equal to square root of 64 so a is equal to a so a is 6 or 8 from equation 1 we have a times b as 48 when a is 6 b is equal to 48 upon 6 that is equal to 8 when a is 8 then b is equal to 48 upon 8 or b is equal to 6 so, three sides of the triangle are 8, 6, 
and 10. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.